Hi there, Abdullakim here with the Epi Info for Rookies channel. In this video, I will give you a quick but complete 5 minute guide on how to make the best use of Epi Info Mobile for your iPhone. If you are an Android user, then you may want to skip this and watch the video in the link above or in the description below. We are going to discuss 6 ways of using this amazing application. The last one will blow your mind. Alright, let's get stuck in. Downloading the Epi Info app. First, go to the Apple App Store and search for Epi Info Companion. Download the application. Once the app is installed, open it and follow the on screen instructions to complete the setup. You may need to grant the necessary permissions for the app to function correctly. And now you have a very powerful tool on your mobile creating a form on your phone. Next is to create a form directly on your iPhone. Yes, you heard me correctly. You can create an awesome data collection form on your phone by simply navigating to the form designer within the app. So go to enter data, click create forms with the form designer and then select new form. Here you can add fields such as text boxes, check boxes and drop down menus and so on. Just customize the form according to your needs. However, if you prefer using Google Sheets, then you can create a form on Google Sheets and then import it into IP Info Mobile by pasting the URL right here. Alternatively, you can create a form on your Epi Info PC and transfer it to your iPhone. To do this, design your form on the PC, save it as a template, then use a file sharing method such as email or cloud storage to transfer the form file to your iPhone. Open the file in Epi Info um, on your iPhone to start using it. Awesome! Entering and saving data. After setting up your forms, you can enter and save data using your iPhone. To do this, Navigate to the NR data section of the app, select your form, okay, then click on open and input the required data, then click on submit and then the app will automatically save your data, easy peasy. Next is syncing your data. To sync your data across devices, you can create a sync file within the app. This file will allow you to share data between your iPhone and other devices seamlessly. Cool, right? So select your form and open it. Click on the share button up on the left hand corner. Yes, right there. Then click on package and email data. Specify a particular password and send this sync file in an email. How cool is that? Performing simple data analysis. For basic data analysis, Epi Info offers various tools within the app. You can compute descriptive statistics, inferential statistics. You can generate reports, maps, charts, and graphs to visualize your data and gain valuable insights. Additionally, you can create a line list, very beautiful line list, to organize your data in a tabular format. This is particularly useful for reviewing and managing large data sets. And finally, what we have all been waiting for, advanced data analysis. When you need to perform more advanced analysis, you can simply transfer your data from your iPhone to your PC. Use the export feature within the app to save your uh, data file and then transfer it to your PC via email, cloud storage, or any other preferred method. Once on your PC, you can open the data in Epi Info for more complex data analysis and reporting. Awesome. By following this simple guide, you can easily and effectively install, set up, and utilize Epi Info on your iOS device. Okie dokie, added Chalky. Now, if you want to begin your journey with Epi Info Mobile, then you'll absolutely love this next video that teaches you a step by step process of how to create a form directly on your iPhone. Hey, Looking for more informative Epi Info videos like this one? Then feel free to subscribe so you will get notified of my subsequent videos. See you in the next one, but until then, peace.